gold bead. How's it guys? Welcome back to you. another episode of Bassing with Sasha. I'm back at the Edenville Quarry to give some fly fishing a go. Um, I do really appreciate your guys' comments that you guys put in my latest fly, fly fishing video. I really do appreciate your guys' input and all your guys' advice. I have a net. This time I can maybe, maybe land, land some more fish. I will be more gentle on the fish. Um, a lot of people said that I'm horsing in the fish. I'm so used to bass fishing that I try and get those fish in as quick as possible but this time I'll let the trout fight me a little bit harder and a little bit longer before I pull the fish in. I've also bought some flies. Um, Jared he helped me out a little bit you know he just um, I just ask a couple, couple of questions what type of flies to throw and where to go to actually have the most productive day but yeah like I say if you guys enjoy these videos leave comments down below hit that like please hit that like it helps my my video go further and yeah I hope that you guys enjoy this episode of my fly fishing experiences and yeah I'll check you guys on the water Thanks. Sorry? Uh, it's a white uh, streamer.
a really good fish. Really good fish. Yes. It's a really good fish. Really, really pretty. Go for that release. Yes, I'm so happy. It was maybe a kilo, kilo and a half. Potentially could be my PB. Really cool. Nice. In my spot again. You guys are right, don't horse in the fish, just try and let the fish do the work and then bring in the fish slowly. That's so cool. Let's see if we can get another one. And I wasn't stripping her too fast either. I was actually kind of slow rolling it. But so awesome, man. A really good fish. I actually got a fish. Yes. <laughs> I'm so happy about that. Really good fish. It felt like as if it actually actually felt like I was snagged. And I'm on again. It's a bit smaller. Actually, it's not a bad fish either. Oh, it's another good one. And this one following it. Yeah. Just try a white uh, streamer. A white streamer. White streamer. 
yeah like a white woolly bugger kind of i'll show you now I was actually slow rolling it and yeah. Just okay. something just something with like a little bit of orange in it. Okay. Yeah, they're quite aggressive, eh? Another really good fish. Yes. <laughs> Let's go for that majestic release. Oh, okay, never mind. There she goes. Come on. At least a third fish. At least need at least a third fish. That'll be so good right now. Let it sink for a little bit. Try that out again. Slow roll it. That's what they've been hitting. This type of retrieve, very slow. There we go. It's a small guy. It's actually not a bad size though. Ah. Oh. Okay, so I have caught two, landed two, caught four on a little white streamer if it wasn't hooked in my finger. Just like that, it's got a little bit of orange in it and it's got a gold bead. I'm literally just stripping it really, really slow and um, that's really what they are liking. But um, I'm still learning and I'm still trying to really figure out how to fight the fish. I have this issue about the line getting stuck in my finger and it's not really flowing through my finger. I don't know if that's just because my because my fingers are wet or dry or the line is dry, but I'm learning, I'm learning and I'm having so much fun doing it that uh, I actually just want to come back and do more of this. It's trout are really, really fun and they're so soft and very hard to hold. Um, leave comments down below how to actually hold trout um, while you want it, wanting to take a photo or release them. You know, I've just been keeping them in the net, unhooking the, the fly and then slowly like lifting them out of the net and then releasing them. But yeah, I'm having a great time and I'm just going to carry on fishing and see if I can't pull out some more. Uh, I would like to catch at least five fish today in my net. That's what I mean, in the net. So 
let's see if this little white streamer works i have another one so if i do break off i can just go and get and if i really 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 do need more i can just go go to the shop quickly and just buy some more No. That's a bass. That's bass following the the trout. It's definitely a bass that. really slow though. <laughs> they want it super slow which is really really cool actually I think they want it ultra slow like like slowly stripping it because that fish took it like that so I'm just gonna slowly drag it. Just like this. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I guess I'll just get lucky. Let's see. Well oh, they fight hard, eh? Quite lethargic these fish. Don't come off. Don't come off. They shake their heads big time, eh? Yes! And another one. And another one! Yes! like that do they <laughs> they really don't like that eh?
There we go. On the pause. shake a lot. Don't horse the fish, don't. That's a good one. There's a bass swimming with it, right underneath it. Check that bass. Yo, it's a monster bass, eh? Thank you. Uh, this is now my, I think it's my third, my fourth, my fourth. There's a nice bass swimming with it as well. There's a nice bass swimming with it. It's a really good one. Still on the white, eh? Very slow retrieve. Slow, slow pulls. Very slow. Sorry? Uh, yeah, you may, if you want to. Yeah, it's right here. <laughs> There's a bass swimming with it. Right underneath it, I don't know if you see see the bass. It's a really pretty fish. That's a big bass, yeah. You grab it? I don't know. Yes. <laughs> awesome. Thank you very much. Hey guys, that big yeah. Awesome. Thank you very much. Uh, there she goes. Pretty fish. I think I've caught four now. Landed in the net, which is great. Um, still throwing that white streamer. I actually wanted to fish this side, the netted side, because there's such a nice little bay here. And I saw some fish in there. It looks so good. But um, I'm going to go back to the dock and just see if I can't pull out more fish. I would really like to catch five. And then once I catch that fifth fish, I almost probably go home. You know, um, Catching five, five fish is a good video and I've redeemed myself from my last fly fishing video. I hope that you guys are still enjoying this fly fishing video. I do appreciate everybody's comments down below on my last video. I want you guys to put more comments down, down below now congratulating me on actually catching fish using your guys tips and all your tricks that you guys have actually showed me or told me about. They are actually working. So I'm gonna get right back into it and let's hope that I can catch more.
<laughs> That's a small guy though. Today you be God. <laughs> I came out here two weeks ago and I didn't land one single fish. So yeah, I think it's a bit of redemption time for me. Such pretty fish. Nice little rainbow trout. Okay, I'm done with fishing today. I only landed four, I think. I'm not too sure, but Ow, tripped in that hole there. Finally, I actually landed a couple today. Not like last time I didn't, but like I said, it was really good fun, fun today. Actually learned a lot today. You guys were awesome in the comments to actually help me out and um, tell me a little bit about fly, fly fishing. I actually messaged James and actually said that he needs to come fly fishing with, with me now at the Edenvale Quarry. He phoned me or he sent me a voice note now saying that if I get 35 comments down below about James having to get a fly fishing rod and setup or fly fishing setup, he'll come fly fishing with, with me. So comment down, down below, then he has to, has to get a fly, fly fishing setup. That'll be absolutely hilarious. And then we'll do a fishing video together fly fishing video together and we'll come out here to the actual quarry and we will do some fly, fly fishing together but leave the thumbs up form for me put the comments down below don't forget to say James has to get a fly fishing setup and uh, hit that subscribe button and I'll check you guys on another episode